Hey everyone, welcome back to our channel. In today's video, we will be diving into an exciting topic, liquid growth ETFs and how they can act as an efficient tool to park your funds effectively. This year has been a game changer in Indian financial market. Zerodha and Grow Fund Houses have launched their first and second liquid growth ETF products. But what does this mean for you and as an investor? Let us break it down. Liquid growth ETFs are designed to help manage your idle funds efficiently. Instead of letting your money sit in a savings account earning minimal interest rate, these ETFs allow your funds to work for you while still being easily accessible whenever you need them. Imagine you having your money invested in something that offers growth potential but is also super liquid. Sounds great, right? So in this video, we'll explore the benefits of liquid growth ETF, how they operate and how you can incorporate them in your investment strategy to make the most of your idle funds. Features of liquid growth ETFs. Now let's talk about when and why you should consider investing in liquid growth ETFs. These are idle for several reasons. Short term, six to eight months. If you're looking for an investment horizon, typically less than six months, liquid growth ETFs can be a great choice. They offer potential for returns while keeping your money accessible. Easy liquidity. As we've mentioned before, these funds provide easy liquidity. You can access your cash quickly without the hassle of transferring from trading account to bank account and vice versa. And these tools serve as an excellent cash management tool. They allow you to park your idle funds in a low risk environment while still earning competitive returns. Further in this video, we will discuss the use case of liquid ETFs as a cash management tool. Now let's discuss how these funds achieve their stability and liquidity. These funds primarily invest in overnight market utilizing government security as the underlying collateral such as T-bills, GSEX, cash and cash equivalents. By investing in these secure instruments, liquid growth ETFs minimize risk while maximizing liquidity, making them a reliable option for managing your short-term cash needs. Now let's explore the key features of liquid ETFs that make them an attractive investment option. High liquidity. As the name suggests, liquid growth ETFs provide income with low risk while maintaining high liquidity. This means you can access your funds quickly without any hassle. Low credit and interest rate risk. This ETF primarily invests in instruments with maturity period of just one day. Plus, they are backed by the government, which significantly reduces credit and interest rate risk. Tracks the Nifty One Day Rate Index. The objective of the Nifty One Day Rate Index is to measure returns generated by market participants lending in the overnight market. Since inception, these funds have delivered a CAGR return of around 6%, easily outperforming typical bank saving rates that generate between 2.5 to say 3.5%. Taxation. One of the best aspects of growth ETFs is their tax efficiency. Returns are taxed only when you redeem your investment and they fall under your applicable tax slab. This means you can enjoy gains without immediate tax implications. In summary, liquid growth ETFs offer high liquidity, low risk, competitive returns and favorable tax treatment, making them a smart choice for investors looking to optimize their idle funds. Welcome back. Let's jump into our first use case for liquid ETFs, using them as a smart cash management tool. Imagine this scenario. Mr. ABC has just sold his shares for rupees 1 lakh. Now he has a few options how, on how to manage that money. He could simply keep that cash in his trading or margin account, but here's the catch. That money will sit there idle, not earning any interest. Let's say he does transfer it to his bank account and later he wants to invest those funds. He would again need to transfer his funds to his trading account, but think about it. 
This process is a waste of time and energy. In most popular banks, he can earn only a saving account interest rate of around 2.5 to say 4% per annum versus an easy 6% had he invested this in liquid ETFs. So instead of letting his money sit idle, Mr. ABC could consider using a liquid ETF. This way he can keep his funds working for him, earning potential higher returns in comparison to savings account while maintaining liquidity. In summary, liquid ETFs can help you manage cash smartly, avoiding the pitfalls of idle cash in your trading account. All right, let's dive into our second scenario, navigating high volatile markets. Picture this, the markets are hitting all time high. While it's an exciting time for many investors, it can also be a bit nerve wracking. In such conditions, one smart strategy is to hedge your equity portfolio. How can this be done? By keeping a portion of your funds liquid through investing in growth liquid ETFs in form of SIPs. Let's take an example of a high volatile market. Remember the chaos during the India elections on June 4th, 2024? Investors rushed to purchase mutual fund units after the market took a dip that day. But here's the kicker. Due to transactional issues at exchanges, many investors ended, ended up getting the NAV of June 5th instead of June 4th. And that's a missed opportunity. Had those investors opted for liquid ETS, they could have simply sold their units on 4th June and immediately reinvested in quality stocks or ETF units to capitalize on the market fall. So during volatile times, a growth liquid ETF can be an effective tool for managing risk and ensuring your position to swiftly take advantage of market fluctuations. The growth liquid ETF tracks the nifty one day rate index. But what does that mean? The primary objective of this index is to measure the returns generated by market participants lending in the overnight market. In India, the overnight market is one of the most active components of money market. This benchmark index was launched on 3rd January 2011 and as per fact sheet dated 30th September 2024, it has delivered an impressive CAGR of 6.36% since inception. In the last year alone, it has achieved an absolute return of 6.85%. That's clearly higher than what you'd, you would have typically earned in a saving account at a popular bank in India. But that's not all. The liquid growth ETF also offers the added benefit of higher liquidity. This means you can access your funds quickly without the hassle of transferring money to and from your trading account. Let's not forget transferring funds through methods like NEFT can also incur extra charges. With liquid ETFs, you can avoid those unnecessary costs and implications. So if you're looking for a way to grow your idle funds while maintaining easy access and liquidity, the growth option of the liquid ETS could be a perfect solution. Now let's compare the two popular growth liquid ETF products on the market, Zerodha's one day rate liquid ETF and Grow's Nifty one day rate liquid ETF. First up, we have the Zerodha Nifty one day rate liquid growth ETF which was listed on January 24th, 2024. As of October 11, 2024, it boasts an impressive asset under management of 2,460 crores. Other details include expense ratio of 0.26%, returns since the inception of this fund is 4.76%, as it has not even completed one year till now. Exit load is 0% and liquidity, of course, it is highly liquid. This fund is a solid option for investors looking for growth, good return with low expenses. Now let's look at the other liquid ETF product. It was launched a bit later on September 26th, 
2024 and has a modest AUM of 39 crore since inception. The expense ratio is 0.29% and returns till date is 0.35% being just launched 2 to 3 weeks ago. So to sum it up, Zerodha's liquid ETF has a lower expense ratio along with high liquidity while Grow's liquid ETF has higher expense ratio and it has been launched recently. So however, Grow's offering may still have potential as it matures.